Now, your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News. Sponsored by Henry Ford Health System. All for you. Good afternoon, I'm Keenan Smith. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. Police were investigating a crash that left a gaping hole in a dentist's office in Dearborn. It happened around 9.15 this morning on Michigan Avenue and Howe in Dearborn. The office is now working to fix that gaping hole in the waiting room. It all happened right next to the kids' play area. Thankfully, no one was hurt. The cause of the crash is under investigation. And today marked the first day of construction for the Gordie Howe International Bridge in Canada. A groundbreaking ceremony took place this morning in Windsor on the $4.4 billion project to connect Detroit and Canada. The new bridge will be a mile and a half long with three lanes of traffic in each direction. The bridge is expected to be completed in 2024. And weekend construction is back on along I-696, and that's going to make getting around Detroit a little more difficult this weekend. MDOT will close the eastbound lanes of the freeway from Telegraph to I-75. The closures are scheduled to begin at 9 o'clock tonight. The shutdown will remain in place until the morning commute Monday when those lanes reopen at 5 a.m. All the entrance ramps will be closed as well. Let's get a check now of the forecast with 7 First Alert meteorologist Kevin Jeans. Hey, Keenan. Well, this afternoon, temperatures topping out in the uh, around 60 degrees, upper 50s, low 60s. We'll have a chance of showers here the rest of today, although it will be pretty light. Chance of strong thunderstorms, though, from midnight through sunrise tomorrow morning. So there could be some periods of heavy rain and strong wind gusts overnight, and then off and on rain through the day tomorrow through Saturday. It's going to be warmer, though, with a high of 79. Could be more strong storms as a cold front passes Saturday evening through sunset. So plan for heavy rain. It's going to be off and on tonight and through the day tomorrow. Keenan. All right, thank you very much, Kevin. And if you're looking for some fun this weekend, try downtown Ferndale. They're gearing up for the third annual October Festival. It takes place this weekend. It starts tonight. You can take part in Stein hoisting. You can also catch some live music there with some bands and enjoy traditional German food. It costs three bucks to get in, and that money goes to local charities. It all takes place on East Nine Mile between Woodward and Bermuda. Activities will take place today through Sunday. Those are your headlines from 7 Action News. Head to WXYZ.com and download the 7 app for news anytime. I'm Keenan Smith. Have a great day. These have been your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News. Sponsored by Henry Ford Health System. All for you.